the official motor coach transportation company for Omaha Athletics. They charter motor coaches for all kinds of groups. Their mission. Kane will control back to Fazzo Ali Hodgick. Omaha having a lot of possession here in the early going. Ali Hodgick's shot goes wide. You know, that's yeah. his. There's a turnover at the edge of the box at the feet of Mendez. He had a hard time getting out of his feet to get a good shot. Irvin's tracked it down, though, inside the 18. He's going to put a cross in. It's come to Mendez. Now he's blocked off, though, won't get a shot there. It comes out to Ali Hodgick, and Mendez called for the foul. I would think that their defenders are, uh, are good enough that they could just deal with them straight up, but um, it's certainly worked so far. Moulton dribbling towards the top of the 18, takes the shot, hits the, hits the post there. And it came all the way out to this near side. There'll be plenty of goals to spread around. See, this is good, this well. is good. They're moving, you know, better movement. Moulton's cross just behind Irvin and Correa again, blasting over the bar. Mavericks, Tigers will head to the locker rooms, talk things over. And hopefully we come back with a more energetic second half. See his number fully. Cervantes passes it up. That guy passes it up. Vu will take it. He puts it across to the back post. There's a good chance there for Pacific. It was from a tight angle. The more Pacific stays in the game and they uh, they gain confidence, the more chances they're going to have like this. Here's another one. Get it. Misses the ball. It's a wide open net. And it's into the back of the net. That is Brian M. Turn it over to Mendez as he tried to play that back into the middle. See if the Mavericks can punish them. Uh, Fazio Ali Hodge has it for the Mavericks. Driving towards the 18, he's got Moulton on the left side if he could find a pass. Too many defenders around him, can't get the ball away from him. Finally now, will take a shot and he's going to score! The way to stay with it, Fazio Ali Hodge put that one in the net and what do you know, we're equal. Okay, good, good. Now Mims is saying, don't let up, guys. Don't let up. You know, you see the guys say, let's go. Let's go. Come on. That's a bad ball from them. Logan Mendez intercepts. He's got Correa, Bolton, and Irvin to his inside. Mendez charging inside himself. Doesn't go wide with it. He's going to take his own shot. He's oh. going to score what might be the game winner. A minute 50 to go, and Logan Mendez put it in the net. Great goal. Great individual effort by Mendez. I just remember the first uh, little earlier in the half where I took it down the line and tried to cross it to Mark and it was just bad so I decided to take it in. I was going to go right and then I saw Kevin open it up by making his run so then I cut in left and just tried to hit it as hard as I could and try to get it sliced past the goal and it, it worked. So whether it's goals, slide tackles, defending, defending the goal, coming through, like whatever it came to we wanted to finish. You know, we've let a couple teams, Washington and UMKC, we kind of let them sniff back in. So we knew we were down and trying to get back into it. So I think that was the most important thing is to finish everything we did. And the results show we did. I was proud of the guys, and I don't know the stats, but yeah, it seemed like we controlled the first half. We couldn't put one in, but I think it's, uh, it's hard. Uh, it's our sport, the NCA, uh, they have to change it. I know we're working on legislation to change it, but to come and ask these guys to come back less than 48 hours later and put the same amount of effort in from Friday night, it's physically impossible and it's not fair to the student athletes. I mean, some of our guys ran eight and nine miles on Friday night with the majority of that sprinting and then you're going to ask someone to come back after they just ran a third of a marathon to do it again on Sunday. It's not fair. And so with that being said, we have to use our depth on the Sunday games and right now early in the season, we don't have much depth. And so we were just trying to save legs, uh, you know, save our guys' legs, and we had to do that. And it showed at the end with, with the goal at the end of the game there. Here comes the ball over the top. The offside flag is not raised. Here's a great chance to equalize. Guinness gets the save. It was Blackman that had the chance. It's probably the final chance for Pacific. The Mavericks get the win 2-1. to one. Pacific gave them all they could handle, but a late Logan Mendez goals the difference. Omaha 2, Pacific 1.